More than 6 million adults have heart failure in the U.S., according to the American Heart Association. But a new study finds a cell therapy may reduce those risks. In today's Health Minute, Mandy Gaither has more on the research. It's a serious condition where the heart can't pump enough blood and oxygen to meet the body's needs. The symptoms of heart failure are often treated through medication. All of this, this, these medicines we use, they're quite successful and they improve, they even prolong life. Well, but that's the only half the story because what about what causes heart failure? What keeps it going? None of these medicines address that. A new study published in the Journal of the American College of Cardiology finds cell therapy involving adult stem cells from bone marrow administered directly into an inflamed heart through a catheter could result in a long-term 58% reduced risk of heart attack and stroke in severe heart failure patients. It works along with the treatments that we already have. So you can imagine, we're, we keep everybody going and doing better with the medicine, and now we have a treatment that actually addresses the cause and quiets everything down. The researchers say their findings should be considered hypothesis generating and that they show this cell therapy concept could work, but clinical trials would be needed to specifically confirm the effects of these stem cells on heart attack, stroke, and other health events. This line of investigation really has a, a great future and I can see that with a confirmatory trial, we can bring this kind of treatment into the mainstream. For Health Minute, I'm Mandy Gaither.